All right, YouTube, this is yet another day right there in Ghana, and then we are doing it the chiri chiri chara chara way. Today, I'm going to take you through how to install Ekato School Management System 5.5, and that is the latest version right now we have, and I've just extracted it onto my www folder. If you have been following my previous tutorials, I believe by now you should know how to um set up um, a folder in your ATC Docs or www folder to start installation of um, any app web based application and um, this is Ekato um, 5.5 I have here and I've created an installer which I'll also be uploading it on my blog so you can download it on my blog to as well and after the tutorial I'll also upload the pre-installed one to as well so any of them you want you can download from my blog but as we always do it chiri chiri chara chara I've already created a database in PHP my admin which I'll be using for the installation and then um now we are ready to set up um, our installation so um our folder name is ekato so that means i'll pick the folder name which we are going to use to start our installation so i navigate back to my browser on the new tab i have localhost then the name of um my application folder which is um ekato so i'll hit enter to proceed with the installation process so now we are loading the installation process and then boom we are on our way to do the installation so First of all, I send a click start to proceed with installation. Then I hit on the next button, and that is going to take me to my next step. All right, so every check is done. Files have been written, so we can proceed with our installation. All right, so here we are supposed to provide um, our database um, um, details, which I have here as my database name, which is Ekato, um, which the database name is um, Ekato 5.5, which is 5.5. So I have Ekato. 55 which is the database name and my username is Avinash and my password is already inserted then the installation is based on a local host so I'll select local host then we hit on the next I'll continue button to continue with the installation and then it's checking database to make sure that everything is okay and database installation has succeeded so we proceed with our installation of the application by hitting on the install button and our application is ready to install important database and so forth and so on so let's give it some few minutes and when it is done installing then i'll come back and we'll proceed all right so installation is done and right now we are supposed to provide our school name um admin name and then admin email address for login and admin password so admin school we have um the viral systems and then admin name uriah avenash and we'll have email which is avenash at gmail and my password is insected which you already no so i'll click on setup me now and then the whole setup is complete and we will be redirected to our login page where we can do what our login into ekator 5.5 which is the latest version i have here with me so um we are logging into ekator and then boom we are there in ekator 5.5 so that is the latest version so you can grab the installer on my blog or you can grab the pre-installer on my blog too as well any of them you want you can go with so i have um 5.5 here you can installed on your local pc too as well so stay tuned to my channel and if you like my video subscribe to my channel like my videos and then leave comments as well as share too as well and invite others to subscribe to the channel someone somewhere is waiting to learn something from the virus system so do a favor and share around stay tuned till my next tutorial